Hi, my name is Paul Inge uh, from Tech Modeler Channel, and this is the beginning of the build, the, the buddy build with Switcher in regards to the Abram M12A2 Abrams Operation Iraqi Freedom. It's a lovely kit, as I said before in my previous video when we had a quick look for it. But as you can see, I've actually undone the actual sprue bag so I can actually see that I haven't started the kit at all. There's the actual wheels I'll be doing dealing with first. The chassis, the whole top, chassis of the whole and the whole top, obviously the turret. And if you notice, I put plastic bags between each layer so that I can actually get to them without damaging each one. I'm just trying to do, show this that basically every bit of the kit is still in its on its sprues. There you go, and as a protection, the bag, one of the bags is protecting each layer as you go, so they're in the box, but easier to get out without keep going in and out of the bags. And there you go, and I've left the decals in the book bag, which I won't be getting out until I actually need them. Poly caps for the wheels, I'll get those out soon as well, because we're not going to start building the wheels together. So, really, all I'm going to do now is put all this, I'm going to lay that gently on there, I'm going to put them back the way I've got them, because I don't really want half this, this to do to details out just yet. So, as you can see, I'm doing it like that, because I can get to each way, even if I slide it out from the side, it's easier to do, so I'm just protecting that each layer as I go down. And there you go, and this one goes on top of there. Right, that one goes there, and that one goes there. That can go there, because I'm not going to put the lid on. And that can go there, and there will be my next two parts to build. So I'm just going to lay them on top loosely for now. So what you can see there is uh, I've got quite a all the bits available. I've also got some extras which I've put over here and I'll just explain those a little bit. The first thing is the, the quick wheels mask for the wheels because I, these work really well. I've got a few for different models uh, but this one will work really well with this kit and also the other Tamiya one, the Tusk 2 version. So this will come in handy completely and if I ever do another one I think it would even fit the Dragon if it come, push comes to shove but I'll just find out when I get when, when I look at that later. So quick wheels which is 049 which fits both uh, all the Tamiya Abrams. <clears throat> also the Tamiya 35273 photo etch set which will be the only photo etch I use in this kit and uh, at the moment I'm saying that and hopefully that's all it's going to be. Uh, apart from this bit of course, which was a bit silly me saying that, is SKP117 which is the lenses and the headlights. So I think they're going to add something nice to the kit when you see it from the front. So you can see what I mean. These will actually be exactly as they should be. And the tail lamps will look, the half moon ones will be look lovely at the back. And they're actually give a nice shot. So they go on very last. So they're my extras. I'm going to put them back to where I've got them. So they're easy to get to. So they're over there out the way. So really that's it, so I'm just trying well, to to decide to show you there and the instructions obviously, we can't proceed without those. I'm just showing you this, so the kit is actually starting in, in the, the, the parts as they are. So I'm going to start the build today and I'll be doing a little bit tonight <clears throat> and then hopefully tomorrow night again. So I'll be dabbling in, dabbling in a bit each night. All I will say is that um, I will be doing videos with the progress as we go through. So this will be the first video showing you the fact I hadn't started the kit to now and it's now, um, what's it, 17.30, no, 17.28, so on, on February the 1st. So this is starting today and, and I'm getting on with it. So here we go. So I would say good luck to Switcher on his build as well. And um, we'll both be, I'll be lo looking out for his channel later tonight as well to see whether he started or he's getting ready to start. Anyway, thank you very much and uh, see you next time. Goodbye.